The Kanangra Boyd National Park is a protected national park that is located in the Central Tablelands region, west of the Southern Highlands and MacArthur regions, in New South Wales, in eastern Australia. The 68,660 hectare national park is situated approximately 180 kilometers southwest of Sydney and is contiguous with the Blue Mountains National Park and the Nate National Park. The park was established in 1969. The Kanangra Boyd National Park is one of the eight protected areas that, in 2000, was inscribed to form part of the UNESCO World Heritage listed Greater Blue Mountains area. The Kanangra Boyd National Park is the most southwesterly of the eight protected areas within the World Heritage Site. The National Park forms part of the Great Dividing Range. Notable features of the National Park include the Thuret Spires, Kanangra Walls, Mount Kalong, and three waterfall systems, the Kalong, the 225-meter two-tier drop Kanangara, and the Morong Falls. The park also features a series of karst landforms that can be explored by those with caving experience. The movie Jetta was filmed in the Kanangra Walls area in 1954. Kalong Falls. Kanangra Walls seen from Echo Head. Mount Cloudmaker. The mountain seen from the plateau walk view from Kanangra Walls. Forest near Morong Creek. Morong Creek Campground in Winter. Kanangra Boyd National Park is composed of two land units, the elevated, gently undulating Boyd Plateau and the area of creeks, rivers, gorges and ridges into which the plateau falls away. The plateau is traversed by the Kanangra Walls Road and can be accessed either from Oberon or Genolan Caves. The road leads to Kanangra Walls. There are several well-known landmarks in the park, such as Mount Cloudmaker, Kanangra Walls and the Thuret Spires. The word Kanangra is generally held to be a corruption of Gundongura and was called Thurek for some time. The national park is bounded to the north by open farmland, to the east by the Cox River, the Blue Mountains National Park and the Kaumung River, to the southeast by the Urandri State Conservation Area, to the south by the Nate National Park and the Wumian Caves Road, to the southwest by the Blue Mountains National Park, and to the west by the Kaumung River. The General and Karst Conservation Reserve, and open farmland and extensive state forests that surround the town of Oberon. The Abercrombie River National Park is situated a short distance, further southwest. The Kanangra Boyd Wilderness is among the largest and most rugged wilderness areas in New South Wales. Situated to the south of Katoomba in the Blue Mountains and the Kanangra Boyd National Parks, this folded belt or rim rock area is markedly different from the Permo-Triassic sandstone-dominated landforms which comprise the rest of the Blue Mountains. There are isolated residual cappings of Permian sandstone in a few places but here the Paleozoic basement rocks, which are elsewhere buried well below the Permo-Triassic measures, are on the surface as high land. Rock types include quartzite, diorite, Devonian rhyolites, rhyodacites, Silurian phyllites, slates, siltstones and tough limestones. The Boyd Plateau comprises a dome of Devonian granite intruded into Devonian quartzites and sedimentaries. There are also intrusive igneous rocks from the Carboniferous period. Kyungra tops at the southeastern end of the plateau is one of the Permian outliers. Its fringing fault scarp, Kanangra Walls, comprises Permian sedimentaries of the Caperty group which rests unconformably on a Devonian Lamy group basement. Nearby Kanangra Gorge is cut 600 to 900 meters deep in rocks of the Lamy group and is one of Australia's deepest gorges. Cloudmaker and Guogong are eroded remnants of Ordovician quartzite. Further east, in the Cox River area, is the large Canimbla granite batholith, and placed during the Carboniferous period. Kalong Caves is another outstanding feature of the area. The main upper Silurian limestone belt, in the Genol and River Valley to the northwest, is 300 meters thick, 8 kilometers long and located in a valley 460 meters deep. This karst topography, created by the Genolan and its tributaries, is one of the least understood in Australia. The complex geology, climate, fire regime, and topography has enabled a wide variety of ecosystems to develop. Eucalypt forest with western plain species, such as yellow box and white box, are found in areas of rain shadow. Forests of mountain ash are found on well-drained soils and blacksland stringy bark where soil is poor. Red spotted gum, Blakely's red gum, red stringy bark and forest oak are also found. Kurijong trees are found in abundance where limestone outcrops occur, and in sheltered gullies rainforest species and blue gum are found. On the Boyd Plateau, the misty mountain forests of brown barrel, messmate, ribbon gum, black sally, snow gum and mallee predominate. High-altitude areas subject to strong winds generally support heath and closed scrub communities. In areas of impeded drainage, various swamps occur, 
dominated by sedges and scrubs such as Leptospermum and Bikey species. About 1,000 flowering plant species occur in the Blue Mountains, in some 40 plant communities. There are over 45 rare or endangered plant species in the wilderness. A unique form of tall open forest occurs in the Ketumba Valley, dominated by Camden white gum, an endangered species limited to these populations. The Blue Mountains National Park contains 46 species of mammals, including 27 marsupials and two monotremes. Over 200 birds and 98 reptile species have been recorded. Several species listed on Schedules 1 and 2 of the Threatened Species Conservation Act 1995 are found in the wilderness area including, the powerful owl, squirrel glider, yellow belly glider, tiger quoll, and brush-tailed rock wallaby. A species of velvet worm has been found on the Boyd Plateau. There are several walking tracks and other sites in the park, these include the, camping is available on the banks of Morong Creek, at the Boyd River Campground, located on Conongra Road. Thanks for watching.